You guys have already been watching the progress on the Pro XP, and this thing is coming along. I mean, it is really coming along. I know that I told you guys that I was going to put the cage on next, but I got Jeremy over here, right there. Well, and if you see around the barn, there's nobody else here. So, I mean, two of us really aren't going to put that cage on because, you know, I'm anal and I don't want to scratch it and ding it up and, and, and whatever, but enough about that. I said, you know what, let's move on and put something else on. So we're gonna get that winch on, cause I need to have that on. And more importantly, what I'm so excited about is that gosh damn bumper I bought. This thing is sick. I'm telling you what, I searched high and low. I looked for all, I looked through every, every bumper available for the Pro XP and I landed on this one. And I just, from the moment I seen it, I knew this was the bumper for my Pro XP. And uh, I wanna show you guys, but I'm not gonna show you yet. Before we put it on, we got to get all these parts off. So I got the, uh, what is that, the plastic cover shroud down there. I've already removed that. And basically you're left with this pull bar. And literally these two bolts are going to pop that thing off. And then you have these four bolts right here that are going to remove these two brackets right here. And the new bumper literally has a whole new framing and everything. And uh, that's basically going to replace this. And uh, you know what, screw it. I can't freaking do that to you guys. I just gotta go get that bumper. I can't do it, I just can't do it. Jeremy, what? dude, go grab that bumper. I get, dude, let's get this bumper. Come on, man. What do you think about this bumper, dude? This bumper looks sick. Okay, I'm not gonna show him. I'm not gonna show him. I'm gonna let him look at waffle cones. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna let him see it. Are you ready for this, dudes? Woo hoo! Oh, look at that bubble wrap bumper. Nah, get that shit out of there. Dude. This freaking thing, as I drop it on the oh, ground. <laughs> I'm glad you're holding on tight. TMW coming through with a pure banger. Look at this freaking thing. Dude, just, just spin that thing around. Let, let the people see. Here, come over here. Get yourself some room. We got to get some room here. Dude, unbelievable this thing is. I mean, this is pure freaking beef look at this look how look how thick this thing is seriously anyone wants to try to hit me after i have this installed go for it because i will be continuing on the trail while you're sitting there like what just fucking happened <laughs> excuse my language that thing is sick so when i found this obviously you can order it freaking powder coated in any type of color you want but i ordered it raw because i wanted to get it powder coated myself and I didn't know at the time exactly what I wanted to do with these speed grates and everything. But uh, luckily for me, well, okay, if you order this yourself, it'll probably come all black. And then the speed grates are black, and it's powder coated and ready to go. You can just install it. But I did request it raw. And uh, thank you to the guys at TMW for sending it to me that way. I appreciate it because it gave me a chance to go ahead and powder coat these, um, that indie red. I did the plate here that pretty much makes their name just pop and then um well you guys see it i can go on and on but i don't need to because this thing's amazing and if you don't think it is you're crazy so this is the freaking the bracket that's going to replace the brackets the oem brackets that are on the front of the pro so i mean that's this thing right here and i mean this is basically what's going to bolt to the frame and then we're going to bolt that bumper directly to this after we got the winch installed and i'm telling you look at this thing man that's gonna crumble. Huh? I said I don't think that's gonna crumble. Oh, it ain't crumbling. Because we have evidence of what a stock one looks like when it crumbles. Yeah, it's not good. How do we know this? Uh, a future video, probably. I don't know yet. <laughs> future video, right? <laughs> yeah. So stay tuned. If you guys haven't subscribed to the channel, what should they do, Jeremy? Subscribe. Right like now. Right, because there's gonna be a lot of freaking awesome videos coming up. Anyways, back to this thing. Look at this thing. What do you think this is, dude? Eighth inch plate. I mean, it's serious duty, and uh, I'm super excited about it. The bumper is as well, very strong, very sturdy, extremely freaking tough. And, uh, dude, look at these guys at TMW, man. Welding in the nuts, I mean, they got them all captured. I mean, that's freaking huge. It's a little, little detail, but it's a big one in my eyes. But, yeah, this thing's amazing. So, with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and remove those brackets because I can't wait any longer to get this thing installed. I know I'm not really going to be able to tell what it looks like because the rest of the thing is stripped down and it's bare as hell, but that's okay. I just want to be able to marvel at this bumper sitting on the front of this thing. So I'm going to put this down. I'm going to pull these brackets off. I'm going to get that bracket on, start the winch, and you guys know I'm running 
the Polaris 4500. So I'm gonna get that installed. And when we get to that point, I'll come back on here. I'll show you where we're at. Let you see where we're at. And we'll go from there. That was it, easy peasy. We got, Jeremy's got, Jeremy had. Well, Jeremy's got, he's got the freaking TMW. What do you want to call that, dude? The bumper plate bracket? Sounds good to me. So we're gonna bolt that thing on. You're gonna use the OEM bolts that you took the other bracket off for, or the bigger bolts that you have here that you use the, uh, what was that, 15 millimeter? Yeah. That went in way too easy. Mm -hmm. I didn't even have to fumble around with it. This, this bumper like thing's it. pretty hard. This is tough stuff. I'm telling you, like, if we didn't make these videos, I don't know what people would do. Be in big trouble. They should show appreciation by how? Subscribing now. <laughs> <laughs> and you should also check out Lulu's OffRoadShop.com for that fresh merch. The same shirts that we've had for months. <laughs> I know you don't have one, so just get online, place an order, get yourself a shirt, maybe a hat, probably five koozies, and uh, you know what? Maybe by the time you get on there, we're gonna have those freaking neck gaiters on there. And if you haven't seen them, dude, show them right there on that chair. Killer, these things are freaking awesome. They are most, sick. Most pumped about those. The color combos you did on those are sweet. Now, don't forget to torque the spec. Man, I can't even get that on there, that one. Unbelievable. I had to use a I'm gonna have to use a freaking wrench. wrench. Yeah. Or an actual ratchet. I used, yeah, I used a ratchet on my. I'm actually gonna have to freaking Do some work. Do some work. What a Unbelievable. shame. Unbelievable. All right, well, as I tighten these bolts down, why don't we take a quick break here and you guys watch a paid sponsorship ad from our newest sponsor. So, winches in. Did not really go into much detail on that. I mean, you guys have seen winches. I've done a winch install video on the Ranger um, a while back. Players' instructions on that are so freaking detailed and so easy to read. Literally, you don't need me to make a video on that. So we're not going to. We're just gonna focus on the TMW killer bumper. Okay, which brings me to, I don't remember. Oh, you know what? I do, I just thought of something. Guys, just while I'm thinking about it, I want you guys to give a big shout out to this guy. Check him out, right here. He sent me some stickers, right here. You guys see this? Dude's name, Arizona Kid. He's got a YouTube channel. He's been following us for a long time. And uh, dude's like always like first to our videos, which is awesome. I appreciate that, buddy. But uh, he definitely gave us a shout out on his channel. And he helped us get to that last 100 to get to our 1,000 subscribers. So huge thanks. I appreciate that big time. And I just want to make sure I told you that. I told you I'd give you a shout out on here. So guys, go check out Arizona Kid, his YouTube channel. I know he's got a Honda Pioneer, um, some four-wheelers. He's running around Arizona doing some things. And uh, yeah, good channel. Awesome dude, check him out. So anyways, getting back to where we're at. Where are we at, Jeremy? Put the bumper on. We're gonna put the bumper on. Or the oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I know where we're at. Sorry guys, a lot going on. We've been talking about a lot of things. A lot of rides. We're build, we're, we're planning some rides. So we've been, I feel like we've been doing a lot of work. Yeah. A lot of work. And we still got a lot of work to go. But doesn't mean we can't take a break and go get out on a ride. And we do have some more ride videos coming up real soon. I just got to get those things edited. I'm trying as fast as I can. Those things will be coming. Those videos will be coming very soon. Hope you guys really enjoyed that Ranger video. That was a freaking blast. Really enjoyed making that one. You did some good commentary in that one, dude. Huh? Oh, yeah. Yeah, dude. It was awesome. You and Dom. Everybody did. It was just fun. Really good day out there in Lulu's land. So a lot more coming from that place. But anyways, we got the winch installed. And like I showed you guys before, I didn't want this blue rope in here. So we're going to pull this synthetic, synthetic rope out. And I got that gray one. So we're going to spool this out, swap this rope over. And then 
I will probably you put your soft shackles and everything. On. Yeah, well, the soft shackles will go in the bin, but I'll have that. Uh, what the heck was that? Factor fifty five. Yes. Yeah, so we'll freaking install that thing on the end of the rope here, and uh, we'll show you that once we get the bumper on, because that'll be on the outside, get the fair lead on, all that good stuff. Ah, wrong way. <laughs> yeah, that was really good. A little bit longer than a few minutes later. And that is a new synthetic rope. Looking really good. Out with the blue, in with the gray. All right, guys. <laughs> the moment, the moment I know I've been waiting for. So uh, off camera, we did take the fair lead wire and we had to disconnect this connection. It's no big deal. We just took a freaking uh, small pick and uh, popped those connections out. And then we were able to run the wire through this freaking hole that they got here. and. Uh, Dude, I'm, uh, <laughs> I just want to get it on. All right, I'm just going to put it on. I'm super pumped. Oh, dude, that's really nice. Dude, look at that. Yeah. Look at that fit. Ooh, all right, TMW. I see what you got going on. Very nice. That is like, dude, that's pretty good. I don't know plastic's kind of whopped out because everything is disassembled, but. Dude, that's, that's You can get to clean. this, too. Huh? You can get to your. Oh yeah, okay, so we can access this so we can change it from high to low. This bumper is looking good. Alright, let's get this thing bolted on. Oh yeah, this Oh I'm Dude! I'm so excited! <laughs> Look at this thing, dude! Freaking BA, dude. This is a top quality BA product right here. Freaking uh you guys from TMW, if you guys are watching this, it's freaking awesome. Look at this thing. Just freaking look at this thing. Oh man. This thing looks amazing. I gotta stand up and look at it from a distance. Oh yeah. You get down low, can you really get a feel for it? You might want to come over on this. Can you get it? Yeah, you can see it. It's just hard to. It's hard to like do justice. <laughs> dude, it's amazing. Oh, dude, I love it though. <laughs> I love it. I like the side view of it the best. Yeah. Oh, dude, it goes hard. Oh, dude, I'm pumped. I'm so pumped, dude. The big ass fair lead in there, dude, just looks so good. So, okay, so we only have one more step before this project is complete. And uh, that's putting this uh, Factor 55. Mount on. So, if you guys got one of these, you're gonna have to take that freaking clip out, pull the pin, basically gonna put this rope inside there, put it back together. It didn't focus on the clip, but there we you go. get the point. There's a clip in there, guys. I'll show you that. Right there. Probably still didn't focus. Nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> she... I see it. I see it. She went bye-bye. Okay. Thank God your eyes focused <laughs> on that thing. All right. Literally pull the rod out, and then we want that to be facing up. So we're gonna stick that in there. Boom. You know, I wonder. Nah, I don't want that metal ring in there. There was a metal piece in here that kept this thing ovaled out at the end, but I feel like that's gonna give us a problem when we go to draw this in tight. So I'm gonna run it without it. So anyways, put this clip back in. She's locked and loaded. Um, Jeremy, you wanna freaking hit the key? Obviously that's working. And so my whole idea about having this ProLink freaking uh, end here is that when you draw this in, I can just have it tight. And that's what it's gonna be like. So I don't have that big hook hanging there, flopping around. Scratching up this freaking beautiful bumper. I mean man, this is this is incredible. I am so Ecstatic about this. I love it. I love it um, But anyways guys, that's it TMW bumper and um, What is it? Is this called the dominator bumper? I believe this is their TMW dominator version bumper for the pro XP and uh, like I said You can get it powder coated you can get it raw powder coated do whatever you want with it 
this is what we did and I think it's gonna be amazing especially when this thing gets wrapped up but uh, that's it it's freaking awesome I'm super pumped and uh, that's it from Lulu's off-road we're gonna be out of here so please like the video subscribe if you haven't and I just want to say thank you guys so much for following us sticking with us anyone that's new to the channel thank you guys for joining and uh, jumping on board with us and we will see you on the next whatever we do on this next maybe a cage maybe We'll see. See ya.